Yo what's up guys, welcome back again to another Clash Royale video and today it is the first day of the Clash Royale sneak peeks of the update that will drop on 4th of July. And today's sneak peek is a brand new arena. Unfortunately, Supercell does not give me the gameplay, so if you want to see gameplay from it, you can go to Mold, Galadon, Pat, whatever. So, here is a screenshot of it, as you can see, Arena 8, Frozen Peak is its name, and it looks so damn cool. Of course, uh, now the Legendary Arena is the Arena 9, and the Royal Arena still remains uh, Arena 7, which is from 2000 to 2500 caps. Um, the Frozen Peak, the new arena starts from 2500 caps, and I suppose it goes up to 3000 where the Legendary Arena starts. And it seems pretty logical that they added a new arena, because the Royal Arena used to cover the range from 2000 to 3000 caps, which was huge, 1000 caps for an arena is pretty damn big, so they have to split it up and now the Royal Arena is only uh, from 2000 to 2500. And then the Frozen Peak starts from 2500 to 3000. Just from the looks of it, it looks dope. This Frozen Ice whatever theme looks so damn amazing. And here is a peek of it inside the game, how like you can battle and stuff, which looks very very good, like that white and light blue theme is so damn well, the graphics are amazing, typical of Supercell, I gotta admit that their graphics are dope. So this was the biggest part of the first sneak peek, but we have some small uh, update news as well. So first of all there were two tournaments announced so far to mode tournaments, let's say. The first one, which costs 100,000 gems, which is like about a thousand dollars of iTunes cards, like holy shit, who, who will actually host that? Like Galadon or Pat? I don't think that I'm gonna host that. So, uh, it costs 100,000 gems to start, the winner gets 6,000 cards and 800 people can participate in it. Now, the second tournament that we know of is, uh, does cost 50,000 gems, it's uh, half cheaper than the first one. Um, the first winner gets 3,000 cards and 600 people participate in it. Of course, uh, we know that the biggest tournament will award 15,000 cards to the winner, so I suppose there's gonna be another tournament costing about like um, 150,000 gems or maybe 200,000 or even more, like, you know, for more ways for Supercell to make money, right? So, among with those, um, I found some small, minor um, changes to the game from the gameplay that Supercell gives to big YouTubers like Galadon, etc. So, as you can see over here, the TV Royale um, is next to the arena, I don't know if you can see it, above the achievements, and we got some new achievements. Unfortunately, we don't know what they are, but new achievements, because there are like a few so many so few achievements right now so that's good and the tv royale has moved to there because as you can see on the bottom right corner there it is the tournaments mode not a huge sneak peek but supercell always releases the small sneak peeks at first and drops the big ones later the update will be out on 4th of july maybe 5th i don't know but somewhere around there so i suppose we're gonna get something good tomorrow and something super super good in two days so that's it for this video guys, hope you enjoyed, I'm personally super hyped for this update, it looks so promising so far and what do you guys think, let me know down in the comments below, so yeah, subscribe if you haven't subscribed yet, leave a like, leave a comment, I'll see you tomorrow with another sneak peek video and yeah, see ya in the next one.